Welcome back to Sexified no Skyrim. No civilized man ever regrets a pleasure, and no uncivilized man ever knows what a pleasure is. Okay. Uh, again, welcome back to Sexified Skyrim. Winch has gone wild, and we are here to chat up Lisette. Feel free to make requests. Uh, Lisette, I think we should talk. Let's have a drink. Not here. Perhaps we can Come get with some me. information there, too. Okay. Uh, she wants to be all private. And that suits me fine. Although I'm bringing my girls with me. Okay, this isn't very private. So, what's on your brain? There's nothing like a good song to lift the spirit in troubled times. Lisette, can we talk? Eh, fine. Okay, I wrote a song for you. I'd like to sing it to you. A song? For me? Just for you, Lisette. If you want to try, go right ahead. Ahem. <clears throat> I gave my love a cherry that had no stone. <laughs> I gave my love a chicken that had no bones. <laughs> she does not like it. I, I don't like it either. I gave my love a story that had no end. Mercy, no more. <laughs> okay. You came to sing. This is a horror show. <laughs> Look, I kill dragons for a living, all right? I did save you from Thane Eriker. Really? You convinced that Thane to stop chasing me? Thank you. I have a good thing going here at the Winking Skeever. I'm sure he'll behave himself now. And about Ildi. I had to do it for the college. You could have just said no. I saw you do that, you know. <laughs> what you did to Ildi. So your arch <laughs> was very of the hurtful. Of Winterhold. I'm very impressed. It hurt because but I don't abuse your wanted powers. Use them to benefit all the people. Oh, Lisette. But enough wallowing. Some of the younger bards need to learn to serve the patron. I have come to accept that. I spoke to Pantia Atia about retaining the services of a bard. We've come to an agreement. Oh, I see. Am I to be your bard and you my patron then, milady? Oh, uh, yeah. Oh, <laughs> wow. And how long might I expect to be in service of such a lovely patron? As long as you wish to be, dear. But you hate my singing. All you need is a bit of spirit. And any song can be made into a classic. All right, let's try something a bit more fun. You'll improve with practice. All right. Lisette smiled confidently and took the bard who had saved her into her arms. She suffered no illusions. Bards will be bards after all. But for tonight, they would only exist for each other and tomorrow would take care of itself. Fan freaking tastic. What do you need, my friend? Lisette, you and I make beautiful music together. Good. Life without music is hardly worth living, is it? Come by the Winking Skeever any time you want to hear a tune. Excellent. All right. Long you think about time staying the night. Corpulus keeps a clean in. Long time coming, but we finally took care of all of that. So I do have one more quest queued up here. Um, we've been doing some like little short things here, and I want to also take care of something. While I was in the Bard College last time, I noticed they had they had a Song of the Alchemist book. I stole it, and I can now deliver that hopefully to Lammy over in Morthal. She's been wanting that book and I've been wanting to get her to train me in alchemy anyway. So we're going to zip over there right now. Oh, I feel so good. We got Lisette at last. She's she's always been my favorite bard. Oh, not Dawnstair. This one with the little marker.
Yeah, and they when they beautified up the women, um, they really did a great job with her as well. Whoever has done this hair, they, they deserve uh, lots and lots of credit. Okay. Is it too late? Can't tell. It's always gray here, but in we go. And I think this might put me what at like 70. Yeah, you guys hang on. We'll have a snack in a moment. Let me. Jorgen and I both work hard all the time. Murthal is important to both of us. Okay. Well, let's see. Since you won't turn, let's just look at you from here. I don't get many customers, but that leaves me time to try things out. If we ever Experiment, solitude, I guess. We should visit the local inn. It's a nice and cozy place. Okay, I found that book you wanted. Ah, oh, it's amazing how much you can learn from a book. Here, let me show you some of the things the temple healers taught me about potions. Nice, so she took the stolen book. Oh, I'm above 70 already. Forgot about that. Nice. The Jarl does not have an acting court wizard due to their right, um, of magic. What do you have for sale? So, you're interested in my potions and ingredients. Ingredients only. And we will just buy them all. I did a little buying and selling before I started the video today. So, we've got lots and lots of gold. Well, you know, 1,200 or so. And let's just sell her some of these bots. Yeah, she can barely afford them. I can sell her, sell her two of those. Nice. Mm -hmm. Okay. That's one less quest in our list. And we got a nice little alchemy bump out of it. Oh, crap. What's gargoyles? Are you freaking kidding me? Lord Nerfin again? Enough of this crap. Girls. Girls, do your thing. I don't want to hit guards, so you just take care of it. Yeah, see, I get in there, I'm going to get the guards. All right, you get him? What's the deal with you, dude? Ready. Oh, he's summoning gargoyles. Where is he now? You are too weak for me. You have to learn. <laughs> I'm like I'm utterly useless here. In every possible way. Who am I kidding? I love to boast. Like I can't I don't even have him as a like I don't see a health bar on him or anything. Okay, finally, he ended his power projection. Yeah, it's like, I can't do anything to him, and if I get in the middle of all that so crap, did this. Um, they're just gonna... Yeah, they're just gonna... Um, oh, what happened? I'm gonna hit guards. That's, <laughs> that's what's gonna happen. So, alright, we'll just take the guard stuff. Poor guard. Oh, what happened? Oh, dead chicken. I can resist everything except Good. temptation. Glad that wasn't me that killed the chicken. So, yeah. I guess we can expect that pretty much anywhere we go, anytime. 
I don't know what this ash pile is, but I can't. Morthal lies deep in the marsh and isolated from other villages and shrouded by a constant ominous fog. Yeah, I don't like it here. I don't like it here. Well, okay, so one Morthal guard died and no one cares about that. Um, what I do care about is getting... Outside of Morthal in the marsh, there is a summoning circle which is used to cure vampirism, I was told. Is that right? I did not know that. She's, she's a repository of all kinds of information. Alright, let's just get inside to the inn here. I'm tired of hanging around outside at night in Morthal. Finally, someone comes in. Kick off your boots, stay a while. Let me know if there's anything I can help you with. Oh, I that's right. These days. We have another lover over here. Let's say hello to Joanna. Now here's a man I'm glad to see. <laughs> okay, let's just rent a room from her. Sure thing. It's yours for a day. Let's have a drink. Perhaps we can get I'll some show you to your room. Right this way. Alright. I got us a room. And, um, you want to drink? Usually, I do not drink. Well? Let me know if there's anything else you need. Uh... God, I wish I could just give her a gift like I can with Sophia. I don't want her to hold on. Let's do this. Okay. But remember, I am a princess, not a pack horse. Okay, you're a princess, not a pack horse. I just wanted to give you something to drink. Um, there. Okay, then. No, no, you're not going to drink it? Drink it. All right, well, here. I don't take orders if you want a drink. No, no, I gave you a drink, silly. Um... What do you know about this place? Hmm, about this inn? For information and rumors, ask the innkeeper. Right, <laughs> got it. Hey, attention, honey. Uh, she's a little snarky at oh, times shall still, we sit but down? you know, she just wants her space, I Not guess. Right Anything new? Um, you may rest and sleep if you're tired. I think we're safe here. That is a good idea. And so, Talos that Lurberg. And so she just quite the reputation in Skyrim that he is widely acknowledged as the absolute worst bard in all of Tamriel. Huh. Alright, so there she is, sleeping on the floor again. I mean she's a princess. I got her a room, but she didn't want that. She just went to sleep. So I'll just remember from this point forward, if I get a room, I'll bring her in the room before I, I talk to her about sleeping. You very well, my sweetheart. All right. Sophia? Yes, I'm listening. Yes. Um, here, I have something for you. That's very thoughtful of you. Well, not really. It's just some wine. And that's the stuff? I hope you're not just trying to get me to... Well, you know... It's been a long time since we've gotten Sophia drunk. Oh, oh, she's a little even more drunk than normal. The Alta wine must must be the ticket for her. Hmm. <laughs> oh goodness, Sophia. It, oh yeah, she's not holding that very well. <laughs> <It's good. laughs> you gonna fall down there, Sophia? Oh boy. <laughs> and now she lays down. All right. That's probably for the best. Oh no, now she's going to get up. Is she Did she sleep it off already? Nope. <laughs> Not even close. Okay, hey, all right, lay down. And where's Ambriel go? She just wandered off.
Oh, yeah, I can't keep track of my girls here. Did she leave or something? I can't. There ain't much to offer. I don't if you see want a place her anywhere. To spend the night, I'll rent you a room. Y you just did, Joanna. All right. So, yeah, I lost track of Ambriel, and she maybe just left the inn. I don't know. I mean, she's not. She's clearly not in there. She's not in there. Oh, Sophia's eyes look all red. I can't, apparently she can't get comfortable. I don't know. <laughs> and Ambriel is not in here either. There's no more rooms. Yeah, she apparently bailed on us. Alrighty then. What's on your, uh, mind? Well... Sophia, why are you looking at me like that? Oh, your head is doing <laughs> oh, weird, bobbly you want things. Something? Um, yeah, I I just want to see how she's doing. Okay, can I talk to you for a bit? Oh, Gorm, how are you I feeling? I feel like I'm being Not stared right at, Anything but good? I can't help. I'm beautiful. Something's got to be done. When That's we're true enough. When we're sure. All right. We Back to partying then. Let's talk about it some other time. Yeah, I think you may have had enough, but either way, okay. I think, guys, we're gonna call it for now. Was there something you wanted? Time uh, to move, I guess. I just wanted to say thank you all for joining us. I hope you enjoyed this. Um, I did. We've made some progress. Uh, I don't know which girls we're going to go for next. Um, I'll have to probably look up and see who's uh, who's left. Um, I do want to check in on the Jarl, uh, but I don't know what what is left for her. Uh, but yeah, yeah, we'll we'll have to do some searching and find a, find a girl. So anyway, thanks again for joining us, and please smash the like button, and I'll talk with you again very very soon.